you're having a prettier day than this, let me know. I want to come hang out with you. All right, no two days on the river are the same. I'm rigged for trout, but there's big old buffalo carp spawning or acting up. I'm at the point where I can usually kind of start walking my boat, so I think I'll do that for a bit. Oh, here's a carp right here in front of me. A couple of them. I guess this is where they'd like to spawn and raise children. I'm literally stepping on fish here. I've tried to fly fish for these dudes using a purple woolly, woolly booger. That worked out on the Columbia River, but these guys want no part of that. So I'll leave them alone. I could either bow fish them or snag them. That's really not the objective today. I was thinking if I was a trout, I'd show up here today to eat carp eggs. This mess of fish. No, I'm not on the keen eye, and those aren't cohorts. Second cast of the year. Reeling in a trout. More or less where I expected to. Well, he's a little one. Stop it. There we go. Now he's free. All right, he got away. I, I treated him like a bass, but he survived. Got another little one. He's a little less little. Getting trout tastic up in here. All right, this is a pretty reliable spot, especially at a time of year where nobody's been up here fishing it yet. Because let's face it, you're going to get cold up here. Here he goes. Alright, I got my flippers on. Gonna work my way up river. This spot wasn't as slap full of trout as I thought, but caught one. I'm thankful for that. Wouldn't you know it? Some old farts in a canoe showed up. So I don't have the river myself anymore. Ah. G Creek confluence. I've been working this left bank for a while. If I could remember how to cast, it'd be better. And wouldn't you know it? Those old farts have shown up again. I just got a little tug here. Normally I come down here and I shoot through there as fast as I can and kind of run and gun and it's pretty productive. But 
but today I think I'll have to circumnavigate these ruffians and work my way on down the river. Now the carp are thick all through here. There's one tailing right there. This sort of thing makes me feel like getting a snagging rig in here tomorrow. But I feel like that'd just be mean. I hope some of this shows up on the camera. gliders that frequent this area. I got the style oh, shoot. I got to stop. I don't know. I guess I'm too far in now. I want to do some more underwater shooting, but I think that opportunity's passed. Looks like I got another ruffian. He's fishing the uh, slot. But he doesn't get up as early as I do, so I got there first. Some of this water is boiling as the normal floor water, but a lot of it is the carp. a new timber it wasn't there last year about a million carp that went there last year either I'm literally hitting them a carp in my paddle. So the water is about 1.5 carp deep. And as I go over them, I hit them. Water and see if I can't, if I have enough battery to do some underwater work.
quick after action report. Hey, uh, the water was pretty cold. There was a carp run going on. Hopefully my filming, I got some underwater shots of the carp. Got a few little trout on the spinner in all the regular places. Just a beautiful day all in all.